ammonia is the best choice and there, there will not be any other game changer. If you go with ammonia as refrigerant, you will not have to replace the system because there are no unknown environmental threats with ammonia. So you will not damage the ozone layer, you will not contribute to global warming and you will not produce trifluoridic acid damaging the, the water. So you can use the ammonia system in 10 years and in 20 years and 30 years. And most ammonia systems are designed to last for decades. So we chose ammonia um, for its properties, um, both functional and from a sustainability point of view. So functionally it works in the range of temperatures that we're working with, um, but at the same time ammonia works for us because of its credentials from a sustainability point of view. It's a natural refrigerant uh, and its potential for, glo for global warming, warming is zero and its potential in terms of damage to the ozone layer is, is, is none. Uh, so for both those reasons, it's a great, uh, a great material to work with. You should invest in ammonia system because it's future-proof, uh, it's extremely efficient, and it's a natural working fluid. Therefore, it's sustainable, and it's not going to damage the environment long term. Within cooling and heating, I think there's a big potential, especially looking through wood, towards heat pumps, looking at the efficiency, but also to the natural refrigerants, which are definitely in the upcoming market. I would like to impact on sustainability by developing new technologies and using natural refrigerants so that the planet gets a bit better.